So what I'm going to offer you today are a few ideas about how you can manage your reputation. What I'll, basically what I'll do, I'll tell a few stories and I'll shoehorn in some ridiculous reference to professional speaking at the back of it. Because that's, that's what we do, Graham, isn't it? That's what we do. Because of its speaker lineups, its attendance figures, and the sheer energy it generates, the London region of the PSA is the most successful chapter of a speaker association in any country in the world. And that is why I attend it. It also happens to be 10 minutes away from me in an Uber. So what I would urge you to do is to think very, very carefully about your reputation. Think ahead, pick your partners, be honest, speak responsibly, deliver more than you said you would. And if you do that all the time, you will always, always have a successful speaking career. Now, if you're serious about building a business, serious business using speaking, then the PSA is the place to be. This is my first time here and by by any standard, it was the best experience I've had with a speaker organization. So make the decision today to make PSA your home. Would you like to know the real secret of how to get the business? Yes, John. Yes, John. Yes, John. Yes, John. Yes. 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 Today, I would like to encourage you to come to one of the PSA events. In my opinion, for a great speaking business, you need both marketing and great content and delivery. Open up your hand, please. Marketing and great content and delivery. <laughs> on the one hand, I was able to witness amazing speakers on stage. And on the other hand, I learned a lot about how to market uh, your, your business as a speaker. And I think for all, all speakers should come along and get this kind of experience as well.